If you didn't watch my video for number 25, I definitely recommend going back. I talk more about what these outline questions are about. But basically, remember, we don't care about the outline. We just want to read the question. So let's take a look. The student wants to emphasize a difference between the Mexicali biennial and the traditional biennials. Okay, so the, the, the key word here is there's got to be a difference between two things. So let's see. In 2006, artist Ed Gomez and Luis Hernandez founded the Mexicali Biennial, which has taken place in 2006 and all these other years. I'm going to stop reading because if it only talks about one of the biennials, how does it include a difference between that and the other ones? It doesn't. It's, it's, it can't be a difference if it's only about one thing. B, unlike traditional biennials, the Mexicali Biennial hosts exhibitions in different venues on an uneven schedule. Well, unlike is pretty much the same as difference, right? So that sounds pretty good. I, I, I don't really care if this is true or not. I could go back to the bullet points and see if it matches, but that's not what they're testing. I only really care about how this information is presented. I'm not interested in the truth or falsity of it. That's not what they're testing. So let's look at C. Let's see if anything gets better here. The term biennial traditionally refers to an art exhibition that takes place every two years in a single location, not to exhibitions hosted at a variety of times and venues. So this is a little bit of a trap because we see that word not, which again, suggests there's some sort of contrast. But are they talking about the thing we need to talk about, the Mexicali biennial? No. Maybe it's implied. Maybe if I read all these bullet points, I would notice that they're actually in secret talking about that specific biennial. But that's not my task. It's not to like assume what they meant by the sentence. It needs to just say it. And it doesn't say it here. So it can't be right. Biennial exhibitions have been held in New York, Berlin, and Venice, but also on both sides of the U.S.-Mexico border. Again, it's not mentioning the Mexicali Biennial, so how could we be talking about it? It's maybe implied, but that's not good enough. B just says it, and that's what we want. The answers to these outline questions are usually just going to say exactly what we're asked for in the question. So don't bother with the bullet points. Just read the question, pay attention to strong words in the question about what they want from you, and then just give them what they want. That's it.